Hey, hello, I am Shadow Mew, and as you see by the title, this is a, uh, yes, surviving 25 days, because I honestly do not have the actual time to, you know, do a whole hundred, edit down the best bits, um, all that good stuff. I'm also just bad at focusing on things when I'm doing these types of packs, because this pack doesn't have too much, but it is still really cool. I recommend it highly, uh, in case I didn't say it. I will say it later, it is Dark RPG, you can go get it on Curse, it is 1.18 mod pack, which adds a fantasy element to it. Pretty cool, and has some stuff that I don't even know how to do yet. So, if you enjoy, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment later down how much you would like to see it, as well as if you'd like to see me try doing other things. Like, say, I don't know, podcast? That's a thing, right? YouTubers do podcasts. Anyways. Hope you all enjoy, and I will see you after the intro. Whoop. All right, so let's see. I'm sure you all already saw the intro and everything, so we got an important choice to pick. We got an origin. We got human, avian, elf, goblin, knight. Arachnid? What? You're able to climb any wall, just not ladders. <laughs> kind of already strict to eating meat. Fragile, you have three less hearts than humans. Wolf, fox, drowned, elytron. You have elytron without need for wings. Gift of the wind. Every 30 seconds, you're able to launch up in the air. What? A shulk, a feline, a florian. Arachne, banshee, daemon. What? There's so much stuff here. Wait, what? Hold up. Uh, Hellraiser is necromancy circle of skeletons, blocking projectiles, and damage. Unfortunately, it's only lasts for a short time. Necromancers have increased health, impervious, study of death, immune to poison, weather, and instant damage, however, do not gain the positive effects. Okay. Dang! I, there's, I honestly didn't look at any of this before I got in here. What? There's so much. Oh my gosh! Alright, uh, let's go for increased speed, better berries, careful gatherer, see berry bushes don't hurt you all, large item collection, slide you quicker. Um, I honestly don't know what I want to be. Goblins are cunning, greedy, jeez. Let's just go for human. Oh, I don't want to do human. I want something special. But we'll do human for a first go around. Maybe that will be something. And bop. Oh, we have a class. Okay. Oh, no. Farmer, rancher, miner. Breaking blocks doesn't cause you to exhaust. Lumberjack, cook, blacksmith, cleric, merchant. What the heck? You start the game with a compass, a, a book, and nine empty maps. Sprinting doesn't cause you to exhaust. What the heck? Alright, um... Honestly, equipment you provide has small buffs. Equipment repairs, repairing equipment costs less materials. Repairing by kind equipment restores more durability. Oh my gosh. Villages you trade never run out of resources to trade for you. Go convince wandering traders to offer you some of their rare items. You know what? I feel like being a merchant. Oh. Well, hello then. This makes me. This is really close. Oh, geez. Okay. MC Dungeons. Guard mode. Oh, we have a bat. That's right. Uh, attack. Sling bag. Uh, Hawk Brand. Yo. Pie of Enchanting. Grants 100. When eaten by Companion Bat. Oh, okay. Croptopia, Adventure Z. Okay then, um. Well, day one, let's go explore. Oh, look, we even have a tracker. That's awesome. I don't even need to tell say it because it's there. Oh, it's beautiful. Um, let's go check this little home. Hey, yep. Am I, why am I so short? It just feels like I am. Weird. Oh, yeah, this is. Uh, I didn't say that earlier. I guess I. I probably. Oh. Ooh, we got a witch. Hello there. Just gonna... There we go. Wah. First combat. Ooh. Got him. Monster Hunter. 
Oh look, we got a a broom. Sleep your enemies off their feet. The crackling broom has smite. Huh. Well, lady, you got anything interesting? Just crafting table and a cauldron. That's probably some lava over there. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna go walk for a bit, and I'll let you know if anything interesting comes up for day one. Uh, probably not, but well, who knows? We'll be back. Okay, so I found a pretty good spot I want to set up to, just because look how nice it is. Uh, we got a nice view over there, we got a nice view over there, and if we look up there, there's like a volcano up there. Oh, I totally am down to like settle up here, so that will probably take me... A little while to, you know, clear out this whole little area. So probably a day or two. We'll see by the time I'm done with it. I want to try not to sleep through building it so I don't waste too much time here. But yeah, I'm gonna be doing this for a while. We might use the black stone to decorate if we get enough of it. So yes, I will be back when I have settled out the home because I don't have that special little thing that uh lets me record and show it in third person, so... Oh, there's my pickaxe. I'll be back in a few days. Okay, it took a few days, but uh, it's now day three, it looks like, over in the corner, and I made a small little house, nicely decorated, and what's that? It's gonna be happening later. And I learned how to use the companion bat. Where is he? Here he is, little boyo. I learned that by fitting in pies when chanting, he levels up. He now has more armor. He obtained lifesteal, so we can just keep feeding him these pies, and he'll just... Permanent ability obtained, lifesteal. Level 9. Level 10. Level 11. Level 12. Level 13. Level 14. And we're going to keep some of these because that's the only way to wake him up when he falls asleep. Went from dying. Uh, Adventure Z Handbook. Uh, blocks, info, items, mobs, entry. Okay, that'll be useful later probably. Uh, decorating your home. Dragon Saddle. Hold up, we got dragons? Nice. Uh, you can come back now, buddy. We'll just set you there. So rest and attack are the two flutes we have. Let's make another pickaxe, because we can head out. And I need to go get wool for a bed. So I can actually set my spawn point. But yeah, this a nice little cozy looking home. Nice ominous feel. Let's see, uh, are there any sheep down here? Don't look like it, um... Oop! You can come back, buddy. We don't need you right now. Let's see, I will roam off this direction until we can find... Oh, are there sheep over there? Those might be. Alright, let's go find out, because I did see white. They could also be wolves. Which... There's a village right over there! Nice! That's perfect, actually. Heck yeah. Ah, oh, they're alpacas. Well, uh, let me walk over to the village. Be back in just a moment. Okay, so we're in town now. And if we look through... Uh, some nice little cozy houses. This one has some bee stuff. You're a forester. You'll buy birch saplings for that. Ah... Uh, if I can find some birch, I probably will actually grow you that, my dude, because that's a pretty worthwhile trade. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything over here for that, dude. There is this house, which has a guild master who will sell me jobs for specific professions, so we'll work on that, potentially. Gonna need to get emeralds, though, which probably won't be too hard. Got a nice little house down here. Might have something. Gonna have to go. Ooh, ow. Gonna have to go adventuring for. The. Oop. What is it? Brain. Think of word. I know what it is. Birch. There we go. We gotta go find birch. Which shouldn't be too hard. Blueprint table. Well, I can't do anything with that right now, so that's okay. Uh. Probably find a way to locate them all down closer to the ground. For now, though, I'm going to go look for those birches and the sheep. 
we'll be back when I find one of those two things or something of note because it does seem like there's going to be a lot of those types of situations happening. So I'll be back in probably a few days to give you my update or a few minutes depending on how easy it is to find one. Well, here I go. Okay, it is day four now, morning time, and I did find a rune portal with Silk Touch Ho that, uh... Is that enough to finish the portal? No, because there's a crying obsidian there. Dang it. That's fine, though. We'll still take the obsidian, and I do see an enderman over here. Who is gone now, because he probably fell in there. Oh, is that another one under the water? Hold up. Is there a rune portal under this little thing right here? Come on, show me the portal. Nope, it's just some magma. That's unfortunate. That's okay. Yeah. Up, up, up. I think it's time to head back home now and drop off all the goods I got. I did not manage to find any birch wood. Though there is a little divot over here. You know what, I'll check here first and then we'll truly head back. But I'm not being too optimistic because it's very low chance we're actually going to find birch in that little divot. It is jungle trees though. Jungle trees might also be... Ooh, is that a mine? Yo, that looks like a mine shaft to me. Let me just uh start digging my way over there. Yo, we could we might have found a mine shaft. Though I didn't I guess I never really looked at what was gonna be in the next update, but that's oop, careful. Just gotta bop. Is this an actual mine shaft? Yo, it is Yo! I never actually looked at the update, so I didn't know if they were going to change stuff like this, but that's actually huge. Nothing that way, unfortunately, but we do have a way down. Okay. Um. Aha! Perfectly what we want to see. There we go. Now we have a spawner that we can use in the future, which is actually huge. I already got the wool I was going to need, but hey, this is just a plus side, right? Let's just dig around the outside of this and get to the other end. Uh, it looks like it just ends there, so light that up. And light that up. Let's proceed. Uh, nothing there. This this also is an exit. Ooh. It's a regular spider. Out you is. Okay, almost as bad, but we sorted it out. Nothing this way. Um, doesn't look like there's anything that way either. So, continue here. Aha, there's some loot. We got oop, some redstone, some bread. A name tag is also... Oop. No. Bad. Name tag is okay. Use that on our bat, maybe. There's some iron... Grab this bad boy up. Yep. Ah. All right, anything of note up here? Uh, kinda. Whatever that thing is. What? I don't like that. Let's check this way first before I... Okay, then. What are you? A giant ge gecko toa. Mythic mounts. I kind of don't want to deal with that, but that is cool. Uh, yep. Nothing that way. That's in a way up. Uh, I'll be back because it's probably going to take a hot minute to actually explore every nook and cranny of this little mine shaft. So, be back in a couple days probably. Away. Oh, look at this. We got two chests. Uh, just some gold and potatoes. I guess we'll take the potatoes, we'll drop the seeds, grab that pickaxe, and we don't really need a bow. And nothing else too exciting in there. Though the redstone is nice. Um, ooh. Nice. Some magma blocks. I honestly don't know how deep this goes down. Alright, looks like that. It looks like this is as deep as it goes then. What's with this magma block though? Um,. They just here just to be here? Oh, well that explains a little bit. Yep. Ah. Oh no. 
Uh. Ah. No, 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 no. Let me back in. Crap. Okay, so it's day five, and I did start everything up by just, you know, doing putting all this away. We can do some stuff with this later, but for now, I actually did look at the map. And it looks like that around the volcano, uh, not this way towards the village, but around the volcano there is actually an area all the way over here that is probably going to have some birch trees in it. So, pilgrimage time. Also, we're going to show you all that nice looking view of the volcano on the way. So, bip, bop, boop. Maybe I'll make like an observatory kind of tower thing to just vibe up here and look at the lava and all that cool stuff. It's a nice idea. I think it'll be pretty cool. We got some lava just flowing out all over the place. Like right there. Just gotta... What? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oop. Move that out of the way. Look at that. That's a nice little view right there. Or maybe we make like some sort of thing right over the middle of it. Eh, we'll sort that out at some point. For now though, we need to get them birch trees so we can get that production going so that we can get some quests. Because honestly, aside from being the Ender Dragon, I don't really got much else that I know I can do here. So, yeah, that's that's about it, really. Do 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 Away! Okay, so we made it down underground after finding some actual birch trees. Uh, the recording software actually ran out for a little bit because I didn't have the storage space for it, so that's a little rough, but it's okay. I can at least uh, get us down here, and then we can go roam around a little bit, which is really good. So let's just build a little pathway here. Bop, bop. And I think I can reach that if we just do that. There we go. Okay. So I'm also low on torches, which is a problem, but we should be okay. I hear you. Honestly, I think- I don't even know what gave me all this really good armor. I think it might be my class? Because I chose Merchant. Which, I guess is- it's gonna be good once I get the birch saplings I need. But for right now, I don't actually have that. I guess the most we're looking for is probably some diamonds. Uh, that would be nice. Just because then I can... Make an enchanting table. I also have zero idea how the Caves and Cliffs update works. So that's a little rough. There's some glow squid sacks. You know what? This is modded Minecraft. Those might actually have a better use now. So bit, bop, out. Pain. Alright, what do you do for me? You make glowing item frames. You know, I shouldn't be surprised, but I'm still equally as disappointed. Alright, um, anything, ah. anything of note, some iron, um, don't really see too much, it looks like. I might have to go deeper, but I don't have the torches for that, so I'm gonna bop this. Ah, it is day six at least, so that's good. Ooh, gold, that is probably gonna be useful. Or something. Don't know what. I also don't know where all the dungeons might be. I might have to actually get like a way to travel around faster on the overworld and uh, we'll go hunting for those. But for this, we're just gonna grab up all I can on the way back and then we'll head on back down. Because I do think, because this is 1.18. Is it 1.19 that has the warden? Yeah, that sounds accurate. Oh well, I will head back up and be back down. Okay, so it's now day 7 and we are underground and I did manage to find some diamonds. So, doesn't look like we got enough to actually do much with them because we do need the 3 to... We actually don't need to. Actually, I can make an enchanting table right now. Ooh, that's actually big then. Because we got the 2 diamonds you need. I already got the obsidian I need from that broken portal, right? I got four pieces. I'm gonna hope I got four. Uh, a lot of redstone. Probably get. Ooh, we can fast. Probably gonna need some more. But, ooh, no. You can get right out of here. Huh. Probably, hopefully, gonna get some more. Shouldn't be too hard, given that I'm pretty sure it's the lower you are, 
the higher the drop rate. Eh, oh well. Should be pretty okay. Regardless. Though I do ooh, is that that's some more diamond right there. Let's go. Come on, give me a big ol' vein. Come on. Oh yeah, there we go. Cause getting some enchantments on my stuff will be good. Probably gonna have to manually make the Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that! Oh, I love it. Yo! So pretty! Okay, so grab all this. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have too much gold for any piglins I find in the nether, because that's probably what we're gonna do next, since, you know, I got some pretty good armor. So I'm probably gonna need to make a new hawk brand, which actually. Oh, wait. Block of raw iron? What? Oh, hold up. Was that what one of these was? Oh, it was! That's a- that's a Minecraft thing? What? Dang, I didn't even know they added that. It was actually pretty cool. Makes this not as bad to do now. Not gonna need to strip mine either, so... That's good. Nothing else. Okay. Uh, I want to just vibe down here and mine until my pickaxe breaks, so I'll be back on the surface, and when we do, we're probably going to go to the nether and try to hopefully see if we got a good spawn. Not holding my breath on that one, though, but uh, we can at least imagine. Also, this is just so pretty. Ah! Oh, wait. Is that diamond? No. All right. Be back once again. Okay, it's now day 9. We got a little wandering boy right here, but he doesn't have too much. And before we head to the nether, I do need to make a new sword. So taking all of this and the sticks, we actually do have some options. So if I go type in Claymore, this is something that we can make. So it's MC Dungeon Weapons is the mod. So MC, that's MX, MC dot Dun... Well... Uh, oh wait, it would be, um, underscore dot, nope, MC. That's all we get. So, weapons, uh, pinnacle, we want to look at these swords. So this is, like, the base thing for all of them. So we do need that broadsword made with the sword, so make the sword. So we can make katana, we can make a master katana, mechanized saw blade. A lot of cool things we can make, actually, but, uh, we will just sort for- settle for a good weapon right now. Um, this is made with a- this is a clay- okay, here's a claymore. Which we can then turn into an obsidian claymore. A heart stealer. What's this ha- this has life steal, right? This is leeching. So maybe, actually, I think we go for that. So this goes into a broadsword. We make another block of iron. Use to make that. And then we just need two diamonds. Some redstone. Make the blocks. So bop bop. Heart seeker. We are just missing. Ah, oh, it was the llamas. I was like, what the heck's that sound? Just the llamas. Make this, and there we go. We now have heart stealer. Sounds pretty cool to me. Let's head on into the nether. Um, I should be fine. We'll use this for now until it breaks. There we go. And inside, let's see. Something good, something close, something fun. Oop. And out we are. Uh, okay. The poor nether grassland. That's a little depressing. A lot of spirits and stuff down there, but uh... Yeah, let's get going, I suppose. I guess I could... No, I can't really go for another uh, nether right right now because I don't have enough diamonds for that. Maybe I'll find some diamond ore, though. Oh wait, this is just grass. Hmm. Unfortunate. I thought that was lapis. Um, just seeing a lot of quartz right now, really. 
What's this stuff? Uh, anchor tree log. Looks cool. Hmm. Huh. Honestly, this is a pretty cool biome. Oh, whoops, I should leave a waypoint at my portal or else I'm going to get lost. It's right around there, so... J... That's not what we want. We want this. Uh, how do I make a waypoint? Uh, N. V. There we go. Home. There we go. Alright. Those were ink bushes, so we can get... Ink sac farm, I suppose? Pretty cool. Hopefully we're really close to a fortress or something, because otherwise it's going to be a little rough trying to get to one. Doesn't look like there's anything that way. And this looks like a whole lot of nothing this way, too. That's fine, though. We got cacti. Man, the only ore here is like quartz, isn't it? Oh, he's not. Ah, nope, nope, they hurt. Oh, pain. Pain! Pain. Whoa, 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 what's that? What are you? Just flying skulls? Gotcha. The heck? Is there not something to spawn? Are those just a thing? Hmm, I don't like that. Alright, then, um... Come on, I know how to do this. Gotcha! Alright, uh, there's... Ah, uh, I don't like... Hmm. Whatever that is, I don't like it. Gross. Oh, that's so loud. What? I think everything broke. There's a lot of Nagas over there. Oh, that's something. Let's head down the way I saw. Ow. Ow. Pain. Oh, okay. Eat some bread. Okay, uh, I got the nether rack to get down there already. What is that, though? Um, just nice and carefully over to it. Do, do, do. Something good. Um. There we go. Then just respawner statue. Huh. So for set your spawn point here. Oh. Huh. So that's a useful item. I can use that to set a spawn point inside the nether. Well, let's go grab some glowstone so I can set that up at somewhere. And then we can head out pretty far without too many worries. Ow, ow. Stupid cactus. There we go, that should be a decent bit. Ow. Um. We're probably going to be roaming for a little while. Out, out. So I will be back if and when we find something interesting like a fortress, maybe a bastion. Oh, I hate these cactuses. Alright. Yeah, we'll be back in a little while probably. Alright, it's day 10 and I found... Is this a strider spawner? It's a spawner for striders. That's kind of funny. Those are some pretty good pickups. The name tags are always welcome. Uh, also... Ooh. Do these even drop anything? I feel really bad for them. Like, if I smack one, does it do anything? Oh! They drop string. Well, uh, that's, a uh, 
pretty cool. Doesn't make me feel any less bad though that that's where they live. Uh, looks like we have something here, and then we also have a fortress down this way, so that's at least good. Ow. Uh, I did die while in here because I did a dumb. Oh, that's something right there. Yo, all oh, those are pig, those are hoglins and piglins and whatever. Oh, you know we gotta get in on that. I think. Do I have any gold near me? I need to put something gold on and hope they don't hit me. They're probably gonna hit me anyway, so eh. Let's just start digging on down then. Be careful not to fall into their base of operations. There is some gold right here though, so maybe I can make some boots. Not the best idea. But hey, it's a thing. Mm, that's just barely not enough. Alright, keep going down then. Okay, okay. Hopefully there's some good loot in here. Oh, well, we got some more gold at least, so. Wow. We are right by it now. Uh, let's break that. Turn off you. Okay, so we got a lot of brutes, it looks like. Are those brutes? No, those are just regular old piglins. They actually won't fight me if I get the, uh, if I get some gold on. So up we is and out we go to get some wood and some other stuff. Maybe. Bad at rhyming still. Don't worry, we'll get there eventually. So, oh, stuck on a stalactite. There's plenty of wood at least with all this stuff over here. So that's not too big of an issue. Uh, also, if I find Endermen, those will be useful because I did learn something I can use those for, which is nice. I need the pearls. So grab that, um, turn you into that, then that. Let's just bring this with us and set it up over here. Hello, Mr. Pigman. Lynn, dude, man, person, thing. Head back this way. We'll just plop you here for ease of use. Make them boots. Perfect. So just take that off, put these on, and hopefully they are chill. Because I'm wearing the I am wearing the right uh, outfit now. I will say that the floppy arms is a little weird. Is that not it? If I pass it, where? It's my little access tunnel. Um. So my thing pops out over there. Did I go the wrong way? I think I did. It's up here, right? Um. Not there. How did I lose it? I somehow lost my thing. Cool. Oh, it's a little baby piglin. You can stay in you can stay in vibe. Well yep. Ow. Am I just dumb? That one surprised me, but um Well I can find the entrance, so that's fine. Looks like... My entrance was like right here, wasn't it? Ah, here we go, it's right here. How did I lose this? Whatever. Down we go. It's also about to be day 11 soon. Okay. They all look like they're not gonna immediately eat my face. Just dig around the long way. And hope that's good enough. Okay. Do, do, do. Dig inward now. There's a brew, but he looks like the only one that's mad about me. Yeah, he looks like the only one that's mad. 
we just fill in the gap. Okay. Drop that there. So y'all cool with me? Nice. Let me see that loop. Oh, no. They were cool with until I did that. Hello there. Okay. Get over here, boy. Oh, that dude's mad at me. Okay. Salute time. Rush down, shockwave, gold. Weakening, projectile protection, heal and allies, cooldown. Um, hmm. Doesn't look like I'm getting anything too solid out of here. Phantom's Mark sounds pretty cool, though. Let's see. B? No. Oh, we have Optifine. That's cool. Just nice and carefully. That is not mad at me, but the brute's gonna be. Did the brute die from fall damage? Oh, there he is. Come on, buddy. Alright, that dude's dead. Are y'all mad at me? Doesn't look like it. Oh. Okay. What? Well, it looks like they're all mad at me. Let's just put this here. Do I even have a bolt loaded? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, take the axe. They're all mad at me. Sounds like you are. He is. Okay, um, bop. Just toss all that down there. So let y'all handle that for a bit, and then we'll just come down and murder you all. You good now? Be oakley dokley. Ooh, that looks valuable. Blue Weeping Obsidian. Spectral Arrows, some Obsidian. Uh, nether Bricks. Looks like that calmed them down, at least. So, you're chill. Okay, looks like they're all calmed down now. Don't see any more Brutes. Uh, we got a smithing table right here. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm probably gonna take your bone. Because I will need this. But nice, we got a nice little piglin area to go to now. So don't gotta worry about that. What's that? Black apple seed, ink bush seed. Uh, yeah, that's the seeds. Um. Oh, I got a little baby hoglin in there. That's pretty cute. Though I do approve of that. Not a sign from that. Uh, it's not like they're gonna have too much. I am gonna get to head to the another fortress next though, but I do want to work on my actual villagers. What's up, buddies? Another smithing table. Okie dokie. Let's start building up a stairway. So, bop. Let me hit you with one of these. And hopefully they don't get the brutes back, because if they do, I'm going to be a little screwed. We 
Dude. Alright, I'll be back once we head over to the fortress, which I think I can see over there. So we'll be back. Okay, so we do have another thing on the way to the fortress, which honestly does look pretty interesting. There might be some good stuff here. It might just be a dud. But hey, we got, what, 90, 89 more days to go? We got plenty of time to find cool stuff. So let's just, oh, okay, almost fell right off into this. Um, looks like it's pretty close to the ground at least, so let's... Uh, I don't like that. I hate the Nagas. I might have to just drop into- oh cool, the fortress is right there, so that actually works out. Huh. Got it before it could wither me. Ah, oh, here another one. Alright, where did I come out of? Was it just right here? Huh. Alright. So, bit, bop, bop. Alright, this time... There we go. Then we just crouch a little closer. Ow! You know what? It's fine. I need I need all my health back. This is okay. Just dig like that. Um, bop, bop. Then we just gotta fill in the rest of the gaps. And there we go. All right, let's go see what's in here. Um, it's not looking like it's anything too crazy. It's just a nice little uh, structure type thing. We do got some black glaze terracotta. Um, just some gold. That's okay, I guess. Come on, I want to see some cool stuff. We're in the nether. Ow. I said cool, not hot. Something good. Something valuable. Something that makes me want. It's really just an empty building. I'm starting to think this might just be an empty building. Um, got this. I hear blazes. Where are they? Um, are they like under the ground? No. Just put that back. Oh well, guess it's uh just a cool looking structure. Ah, ah, spooked me. Man, that's a little disappointing, but I guess that's okay. Because now we can just head on over to the fortress then. And hopefully there's some good stuff here. I see. Ah, that's a hydrogen jellyfish. That is the thing that killed me last time. For those who don't know, the hydrogen jellyfish is a bomb. That explodes upon being smacked. So if you see one, uh, don't do that. Tips. Oh. Oh no. That's a. That's a. Ah crap. Mm. All right. Uh, heart seeker. Get him. Alright, okay, so the healing does work. Okay. Gobble up the food. We got three blaze rods out of that, and... Okay, we do have a secluded blaze spawner. That's actually really solid. We're just gonna... Oh, it... It's underneath of it! Okay. Um, and B. There we go. Blazes. Confirm. Alright, that's pretty cool. We have a guaranteed blaze spawner. Um, there might be some stuff this way. Nothing that way, nothing here. Shouldn't go complicating anything by going down branching pathways just yet. Though it's starting to look like this might just be a dead end, ain't it? Mmm, yeah, it's a dead end. Okay then. Um do, 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 do. Probably just gonna let y'all know if I find anything interesting. Doesn't look like there's anything too cool here right now, so 
let's just check to see what I can do with quartz real fast before I do. Uh, okay, what about block of quartz? Uh, okay, inferno suit for the bat. That's pretty cool, actually. Um, I'll take this just in case I feel like doing that. Might be cool for the bat. Yep. And I will be back if something interesting is found. Alright, didn't get too much uh, in there. I did find this the other day and I forgot to mention it, so... Oh! Wait, that leads somewhere. Hold on. You want me to go this way? I was gonna do something else first. I should probably still do that because it is a worthwhile thing I was gonna do. Which was village trade because I need to get this worked out because there is a guy in there that will buy pottery so take that and I will go work on that real fast so I can get this all sorted out but then once I do so I think I'll actually be able to do some pretty cool stuff so I'll be back it's day 12 I think I already said that we actually get to stuff the village which is nice I don't have enough birch trees for the one dude but it's whatever just need to make sure they all stay alive. I might need to lure them into like a small little containment field area. That sounds like something I'm probably going to have to do. Really fine though. We'll do it at a later point. We have a nice flat area for that too. So I'm going to go get the clay I need for the pots. Make all those because if you remember, I'm a merchant. Which means that all the villagers will not run out of their goods. Oop. So with that, I should be able to get up a nice bunch of clay, get it all smelted up. We'll just cut down some tree while I'm at it. Whop. Thank you. Just clap these boys down. Okay, and I'll be back in a bit. Okay, it has taken several days now. It is day 14, but I finally have all the clay pots made. Uh, we have two stacks. And six extra ones, which is actually kind of big. Oops. Uh, that's not there. Okay. So now we just gotta find the boy. I can sell him all of my pots. And we're gonna get a nice handful of... Uh, emeralds. Why is the water back? I thought I got rid of all the water. Huh. Honestly, this village kind of got murdered by a really poor... What is it? Spawning? Hello, buddy. I have some pot for you. You're a cartographer. You're the wrong person. Okay. Uh, that, that's, he must be over here then, right? There's no way I don't have him. Like, he has to be, like, all the way at the top? Yeah, he's probably, like, all the way up here or something. Honestly, I didn't even realize, did I actually go up here originally? I don't think I did. Buddy, what are you doing up there? It's dangerous. Uh, what you got in your chest, though? Ah. Uh, some emeralds, actually. That's pretty huge. We'll take those. Ow. So that means it's this house? Yeah, this one looks like right, the right one. Hey, yep. Yeah, you're the florist, so you will take my pots. Nice. What a deal. We got 25 out of that. Uh, ooh, emeralds for vines. Actually, pretty solid. Can I level up? Are you missing, like, just barely enough? Or do you need, like, the last little bit? Do you need me to buy one of these? There we go. Uh, honey bottles is okay, actually. Can I use these for anything? Probably. Uh, we got a cartographer, which is also good. But I'd rather we ha not have a cartographer. You are a forester. You take the birch saplings I have at home. Uh, that's fine. Okay, so... The thing I wanted to make requires this. I have to do an actual table. I don't actually have the ability to make it right immediately. But with some cobblestone, I should be able to. 
And hopefully I don't have to smelt it down because I didn't take my furnaces with me. Uh, crafting table? None. Okay. I might have to head back home to make this. Uh, no, I could just take this. There we go. Alright, so what I'm making, it should be a easy to make recipe. We take that. We throw these together. We got a lot of emeralds, actually. Those pots were worth it. You make abyss watcher eyes. And we can make... Uh, we can't, because I need obsidian for the base. And I need stone anyways, so... Unfortunate. I'll be home, and I'll do that in a second. Alright, so waystones are set up. So how this works is I just right-click it, teleport back and forth. It takes a single level. I also made a scroll, so I can just uh, teleport home after we go find out where this thing takes me. So, uh, following the direction it did last time, looks like it's this way. I shall begin my trek, and we'll see where this takes me, because I'm actually really curious where it will go. I should prob... Hmm, should I make one? Yeah, I should probably make another one just in case, so I can plop it down when I get there, so I don't... It's not just a one-way. Um, yeah, I'll do that, and then pilgrimage will begin. It'll probably take me a while, so I will be back... If we find things on the way, we find anything, no. Uh, we get there. There's the one flint I need, so let me head out. Oh, hold up. What we got over here? Ah! I see. We're just gonna create a waypoint right there. Monument. We'll do that at a later date. Right now, I don't have anywhere near the ability to do so. So, hello, Mr. Guardians. You're all pretty nice. I don't want to deal with you right now. Get away from me. Uh, yeah. Still sailing, because now we have to for whatever the star is leading us to. I'm kind of excited. It's day 16. Hopefully it's something cool. That's all. Away we is. Okay, seriously, another one? I do see something else on the map nearby, like right around here. I don't know. This is still leading this way. Uh, let's quickly dive down and see if this is something of interest. Ah, it looks. Oh, I see. Ah, it's a, it's a drowned temple. Okay, okay, I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Uh, we gotta deal with this lad real fast, but I think we can actually get in there. Ooh. Get over here. Get! Jesus. That is so much damage. Stop! There we go. All right. Um, actually, I should probably wait till I have full air to go back to, to go in here. All right, and down we go. You slide in here. Oh. Come on, break it faster, break it faster, break it faster. Come on, break it faster. Okay, okay. Ah! Okay. Ricochet. Ah, that's unfortunate. Not too bad, though. Ah. Okay, we got our air. Heal up. Grab the diamonds. There's a dude throwing trident at me. Oh no. Come on. Ah! I see where he is now. I think the best option we have right now. Alright, um, is. Come on, break that. 
And okay. Whew. That was a little too close. Uh, prismarine blocks can't be used for anything. Magma block. Be a chimney. Don't care about that. Okay. Uh, eat this food up. And maybe we can, uh... Okay. Oh, that's a heart of the sea. That's actually something really useful. Which can be used for a Merling Scales. Gives it swim, try the unslowness. Wait. Aura of Conduit Power? What? That's actually nuts. Uh, is this Dark Prismarine? Oh, it is. Oh, it is. And we got the Premarine block. Oh, that's bricks. That's Premarine. So we grab that and oh man, our bat's about to be nuts. Eh, nothing too crazy in here. I'll take the emerald for that. No. Nope. Okay. Alright. Then the next problem is getting back out, but if I can get my bat that ability, that's actually pretty nuts. Up, 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 up. No. Okay. No. Oh, that's a problem. Okay. Ah! I gotta break it before I can get out. Grab up my air again, because now I need it. And I should be able to escape pretty easy. Mm. Let me out. Nope. There we go. Oh, we made it. I hear you, but you're not gonna get me. Alright, um... Where's the monument? The monument's that way, so we head this way. Alright. We continue the adventure, and I shall be back if we find anything of note. Once more. Alright, it's day 17 now, and I found a treasure map, but I went to go look at it, and... Uh, not that. Uh, we can actually feed that, but we found a class for my pets. So if we just, uh, send you out... Oh yeah, you're just set permanently to attack mode, aren't you? Good boy. Have a pie. You can't eat that. Uh, that's fine. Uh, do I want to give him this class? I kind of wanted the water one, but... I mean, for right now? Just give him this. Table looter jacket. Do I just... You know what? Yeah. Do I... How do I give this? Do I got a... Um... How do I put it on him? It can also be turned into a spirit shard, which, okay, that's how we can make anyone we want. How do I put it on him? I guess we'll hold off on that for now. We'll just put you back. Toss that, we won't need it, and I will go back on my adventure. I will also check how to make that, but if I can actually put that on him, that don't seem too bad. Uh, there's my boat. Alright, sailing away! Okay, real fast, I found out how to open it. You just gotta shift right click them. It turns out that I maxed out Vampire, and it gives you the ability, so he just permanently has lifesteal. If I put this on him... I can buff him up to have permanent looting. Oh, that's not the boat. That's pretty sick. But yeah, we're sailing, so away! Oh, buddy, I think I see it. The only problem is I did end up dying on the way here. Got most of my stuff, but not my chest plate. Which is an issue, but is, if this is where we're headed, I think that might be it. Let's head to the side and see if it swerves. So, uh... Hopefully it's... Oh, definitely not over the over the hole. Let's get over here. Um, there we go. Does this swerve? Oh yeah, no, this is it. Okay then. Uh, let's just drop the waystone down. It's gonna cost one level. Oh, that's pretty good. Head home. Nice. I need more food. I need more supplies. 
Uh, we don't need that. Don't need those. Don't need that. You can go in here. You stay. You don't. You, you. Uh, we got Ricochet, which isn't too good because I don't have a bow right now. So, bop. Got all this in here for now. Alright, so one, two, three. There we go. I'm probably not going to need the boat or that anymore. Where are those pies? So, where are you, buddy? Eat these. Looter level two. Obtain looting. Let's feed you all these. Aura of luck and permanent ability. So... Shift click that. He's now max looter. Huh. So I, he has a bundle. Do I like throw something in there? I don't know. Let's keep him out though for the fight. And let's make some, ar some iron armor. Because that's definitely going to be needed. Ah. Sucks I'm missing my chest plate, but it's okay. We are still okay in the armor department. I need food. Toss that up in there. Um, let's take the pork chops. Let's cook. Actually, I might just cook all my food before I head out to it again. That sounds like a good idea. So we'll be back once we're headed back to that tower thing. But oh boy, here it is. Ah! Okay, it is now day 20, and we are heading into whatever this thing is. It looks like it might have some good secret. So, bop, 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 bop. So there's no way up. Ah. Chest right here. Okay. Um, just some ice and some other stuff. Shush out there. Probably use that for something. Um, how do I? I guess we just. Oh, yep. That was some like strays. Yep. Um. Just gotta break in nice and careful. Well. There we go. Let's break that. And there we go. Um, bust in like so. Nice. Block, block. Okay. So block. There's no boys up here. Um, gotta go a little higher. Oh. Well, that looks like the altar I need to use. So, good to know. Um... Probably should just go cut down a tree for this. Do do do. Oh, there's a there's another altar. Um. Oh, I need four. So we can't even do this yet. How? Uh, can I use ice for anything? Oh, I can. Like smoothies. Yeah, it's ice. Okay. Um, let me go. Grab more wood real fast do, 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 do. we might need to just how would I get more I already broke I already broke oh well that was not the that was not intended up we go all right um I'll be back with my findings but I'm pretty sure we need three more of those little star things to get Inside of whatever that is, so bop ba da oh there we go. Alright, be back. Okay, day twenty two and I do have the little villager safety hole made. So now I can talk to the guild master and actually build a uh build get a job, so Bop Bop. Alright. So I have two lumberjack quests now. Hopefully he wants just this wood. Miner chef. Okay, so how does this work? Congratulations to the guild. You can now accept complete quests through the guild GUI. I wear tiny edge tech and technology. Complete quests will get you fame. Grant requests, prestige professions, may luck. Oh. Wait. Oh. Your art. Ah, okay. So I see. You're not supposed to take two of the same one. But 
You're supposed to take one of each. Let's take that. Take that. And I guess Chef doesn't hurt. Alright. So now we can accept one of each of those. And I guess I have to buy another one. Kind of don't want to because I don't have the ability to right now. Um, you there, Forester. You still want birch. That's annoying. You, Cartographer. You want paper. I don't got that either. Um, let's hit J. Okay, so... That's annoying. That's fine. Um... I guess the coal I can probably do easy enough. Let's head home. Close that up. Knowing that it wants dark oak. Uh, I guess you can't really stop it, stop the game from still wanting to play with you. I don't even have enough coal for that. Ah, okay then. Um, kill zombies of 18. And 17 bones. I have the bone part. Hmm. How do I find a good way to generate zombies? I guess. Let's see. Um. Is there anything of no above land I might want to look at? Not particularly. I highly doubt there's anything underneath the mountain. Um. Dang, this does suck. I need Zambinos. So, let's spend the night doing that, I suppose, because I need to make a lectern and I need leather, so don't be running around for that. Probably just going to murder the cows. Oh well, here I go. Okay, day 23. Uh, we are sailing on the water looking... Oh, what's that? Oh, look, a village! That's convenient. Also, turtles. I love them. Hopefully these boyos have a Waystone here? I'm not terribly far. I guess I can just steal their stuff and leave, can't I? That's entirely an option I have in my disposal. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Uh, ooh, I want that. Yoink. Goodbye. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna go look around town then. And again, we'll be back if I get what I need or if they have something stupidly good. Probably not, though. Okay, it's not the night on day 23, so we're just going to slap this right here. Give these boys some beds, like that. Right there, and right there. And one of these dudes should turn into the boy. Florist, Guildmaster, the Forester, and you are the Cartographer, which means you, my lucky man, are the boy. Let's just... I don't have my bed. Thing. Uh, yeah. That sucks. I do need to kill stuff anyway, so... Do, 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 do. We just head on out. And we'll be back when it is daytime and they are awake after I have completed these quests. hi -ya. Oh lord, looks like we got us a zombie horde! That came from my boys. It took me a minute because I was like, huh, that's a lot of zombies. But then I realized, oh... Wait, that's a mechanic. Well, uh, it's a good thing they really can't do anything about my boys. Oh, it's another one of the stars. Let's go! Oh no, you shouldn't be hearing that. Well, uh, shh. Guess the YouTuber, if you're able to actually hear that. Probably were, though. Oops, a daisy. Oh well, I'll be back in this daytime still. There we go. Day 25 on the dot. We got our mending boy, so let's just lock him in with that purchase right there. Alright, now we can head home. I just gotta grab a couple book. Or a singular book, because I don't think I have enough to make more than one. So, bippity bop. There we go. And we can head on back. Oh, dang, they spawned, a bit. They spawned an iron golem. Nice. Uh, have some bread. Then give me that mending book. Oh, you're lovely. 
Now I can put mending on heart stealer after I enchant it. Everybody, I've already eaten all of the bread. That's kind of crazy that you already did that, but uh, hey, I'm not going to say anything. Bread be bread. Uh, it's also, what can I buy from y'all? Ah, I can only buy one of that. Um, yeah, I'll keep the one honey bottle. We'll head back home. And yeah, we got a nice little home. Oops, I need to fix that. We got a nice little home. We got... What? A little village containment. We have a curious little thing that we can go do at some point once I have the right stuff for it, which... I don't know how to get these easier. Um, but let's go plop this bad boy in. Let's see, do 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 do. Oh no. There we go. Yep. So I did make a stairway on the outside of it so I can actually get up here easier. There we go. Alright, so now we just plop. Come on. Just plop that in there. We should only need two more and we'll be all set. So let's see. Is there anything of note around here I want to go check out? Kind of want to go check that out. Um, it's not really too much here. That's where I died before, but I already looted whatever was there. Um, well, no, I think we'll just head on back. And we can sort out our options for what y'all would like to see in the next 25 days. So, home. So, number one is that we could probably work on making a mob farm before we actually go do any end stuff. Because if we make it clear, we can turn all the wrong flesh into that and bada bing, bada boom. Uh, maybe a cow farm, because I do have wheat growing here. I honestly don't know. I'm not too good at builds, so I don't know if I could do that. But, uh, yeah, pretty, uh, pretty good start, I'd say. So, if y'all enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And once again, thank you all so much for your continued support. See ya.